Hey, what is up guys? So today I'm going to be showing you how to do this super easy effect inside of Final Cut Pro with selective colors. So all you need to do is select the clip that you want to apply this to. I just have this one right here and you want to make sure that you have a contrasty color in it like these flowers here. So just drag that onto your timeline and all you're going to do is go to video effects, color correction, and drag that on. Now go to the inspector and right at the top you'll have this little thing come up. It's for masks. It has a shape mask and a color mask. So that's what you want to do. Click on the color mask and select the color that you want to mask out. In this case it will be yellow. So you just drag it until more or less only that color is selected. And you can see in this shot it works very well because there's only one shade of yellow in the entire shot. So once you have it, let go and it will be selected now. And now go into the color board right here. And basically you can change this yellow tone now to anything you want. So if I want it blue or green. So in this shot I thought the orange looked good. So I just set it like that. And now as you can see throughout the entire shot anything that is yellow is now orange in color. I mean it doesn't look realistic but it still looks cool. The only other little thing I did in those example clips was faded in. And the way that I did that is simply by copying the clip duplicating it, putting it on top, and on the top clip, go back to the inspector and turn off the color correction. So now it's just back to the normal yellow. And now go down and set the opacity for the beginning to be 100%, set a keyframe, and then go however far you want and change the opacity to zero. Now it's gonna fade from 100 to 0% and the orange color will fade in. Anyway, this is just a really quick tutorial on some stylistic looks you can do inside of Final Cut really easily. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.